Last year, we came off of 2023 with several inches below average as far as overall precipitation. And now, several people in Terre Haute have reported their wells going dry. It's a problem that could be caused by that lack of rain that we had last year. Now, homeowners who rely on wells are left feeling uneasy. News 10's Madison Zaleski caught up with some of those residents to find out how they're being affected. Like many people who rely on their private wells for water, longtime resident Darian Scott says his well has dried up multiple times over the past few months. There was times where he had to pay attention to how many loads of laundry he did or, you know, not to stay too long in the shower. Um, and whatnot, so it's, it made it very tough towards the end of the fall last year. And this problem has left Scott to haul water multiple times from a nearby area to his house. It's pretty tough. I mean, you're spending a couple hours trying to haul water, depending on how far you got to haul it, um, getting the you know necessities, the tank and pump and stuff to haul it and dump it in. I've considered maybe getting a, new, a deeper well, having to come in and drill it, but it just comes with the cost. Scott isn't the only person dealing with this. News 10 asked our viewers what their experience has been, and it's a problem many people are facing in the local area. Devin Smith with Smithwell Drilling says he's been flooded with calls from homeowners who are desperate for new sources of water. We've had to go back and drop pumps deeper um, as well as a few of them had to redrill. A lot of people are in formations that there's just not much we can do about it. Smith says wells rely on rain for water, and with little rain this year, the water tables are getting lower and lower, making even the deeper wells drier. In 2012, I think was the last drought we had, and we had similar issues, and uh, this year seems like it was, to me, a little worse than it was in 2012 as far as the water table dropping. Smith says some wells may be more directly influenced by the lack of rain. Shallow hand dug wells are often the first wells to dry up during a drought. The only natural solution to the drought problem is more rain. In the meantime, Scott will continue to conserve his water until that happens. Just make sure people are keep an eye on your well. Um, you know, watch how much water use you're using, uh, especially like I said, we don't know what we're going to have come spring and fall, uh, summer again. If you notice your well is dry, you should talk with a local well driller to determine the best solution for your situation. Reporting in Terre Haute, Madison Zaleski, News 10. While there could be some promise as far as the longer range outlook for rainfall, look at this. This is from the Climate Prediction Center for March, April, and May this year, 2024. Look at this. See, this is above average precipitation. So if this pans out, it's only a computer model, but if this pans out, we might very well be able to get enough water to replenish some of those wells.